Do you know that moment when your heart is pumping really fast or your hands are like this? Or you just like don't feel like doing something? That's the moment where you find this imaginary line. It's your comfort zone. Five years ago, I knew unconsciously where my comfort zone is when it comes to speaking. I don't want to stand on the stage. I never told myself that, but unconsciously I, I knew that. I went to a huge event with a lot of speakers, and there was one speaker, I loved his speech. So after the event, I went to him and said, hey, where did you learn to speak like that? And he said, go to Toastmasters, it's in every city. It was not some magic trick. I had to work for it. That was basically how I understood, understood the answer. So, what did I do? I joined Toastmasters. And in the coming years, boy, this comfort zone, it was not imaginary. It was like a brick wall. Every time you go on the stage, your pulse is going up, you like, can't think clearly. But every time you push it a little bit farther, Sometimes it comes back because you get lazy and don't visit Toastmasters, I have to be honest with you. But then some other Toastmasters calls you and says, Hey Danny, you've not been here for a long time, come back. And then you push your comfort zone again. And you push it and you push it. And one day you go as far as you didn't never go before on a contest, for example. Or at a private event, your speeches are getting better and better. And then you realize, wow. I did a lot to push this comfort zone. So think in your life, where is the point where there is a comfort zone and what you can do to push it further away and I guarantee you, you will be, feel better and live a happier life.